Stolen credit cards, possible getaway car. It sounds like Eric was about to go on the run. Only the killer got to him first. Okay, so if Christopher didn't kill him, then who did? Maybe whatever Eric was charging on those cards could give us a lead. Unfortunately, cards are a bust. Uh, ran the numbers, no recent activity. Did we ever find those cards? Uh, no, not in his hospital locker or his apartment or in his body. Maybe the killer took them. Well, I'll have Tori monitor the numbers, see if any activity pops. I think I got a lead. So we're really thinking that this killer is not Christopher Carlucci, right? Yes. Maybe. No. Oh, come on. The guy is guilty. Nobody thought otherwise until Castle over here started moonlighting for the mob. I think that might be overstating it a little. You took a blood oath. You let them turn you into an honorary mobster. What's wrong with you? Oh, come on, man. How many people outside of the mafia ever get to swear omerta? I think it is the experience of a lifetime. Of course you do. But didn't you say you had a lead? Yeah. The lab was able to identify the crystals that Laney found on Eric's sleeves. They're made up of sodium ferrocyanide mixed with sodium chloride, which means... It's road salt. It hasn't snowed in weeks. So why would Eric be literally up to his elbows in salt? I don't know. But there are only four salt depots on the island, and one of them happens to be within three blocks of our crime scene. The blue backpack. We searched for it, we never found it. That's because just before Eric died, he hid that bag. The salt depot. And the places we go to follow a lead. But if it points to our killer, it's worth it indeed. If that's you trying to help me with my poem, then it's not working. Right over here. This is where Eric gained access. Wait, is that the, uh, right there? The victim's blue backpack. You were right. Eric must have stashed it here before he was killed. Yeah, but what is he trying to hide that he didn't want anyone to find? Bloody clothes? With bullet holes. 